Well, folks, welcome back to another vlog and another video. My name is Alex Holbrook here. I'm uh, just um, uh, coming to coming to say in uh, this vlog, I decided to do lava lamp challenge. And as you can see, I have two lava lamps all set up right here, and they've been running for a while. And uh, this one here looks like is almost ready to um, uh, ready to start producing. And I'm sure this one here should be pretty close too. These two lava lamps I got um, a long time ago. This one right here is this one. This one right here is much newer than this one. This one right here is much newer to me than this one right here. Of course, they're both still in really good condition. This one, I this one over here I got a long time ago as a belated uh, Christmas gift. Way back at uh, the end of. Uh, Christmas time, uh, 95, I believe it was. This I got a few years back around as a, as some kind of just personal gift around uh, Easter time, 2012. So basically what I thought I'd do today is, um, uh, you know, lava lamp challenge where we see which lava lamp seems to seem, which lava lamp we think seems to be better. Well, and I think perfect timing because this one right here is, is starting to produce. This one here might take a little longer, this, this one right over here. But, oh, yep, it, here goes this one. This, this, one's, this one's already producing. Keep watching. Move the cam. I move the. I move the chair that that the camera is uh, sitting on a little closer, so you can see the lava lamp producing a little bit more. I knew you could still you could see the lava lamp back there where I, where I had it to begin with, but I wasn't sure you could see it producing. Well, this one here is starting to move a little bit more. Oh, now I think I start now I, now I'm starting to see this one right here starting to move. There it goes. Yep. You got to let the lava lamp sit for a while. You know, long enough to heat up and stuff so that all the stuff inside can start floating around. And Yep, so Yep, as you can see they're both going at it now. So, so, so if, if and when you watch this video, leave a comment down below on which lava lamp you think, you, which lava lamp you like better, whether you like this one right here or this one right here. And, uh, and let me know whether you think this one here or this one right here is better. In your opinion, when you leave when you leave a comment down below when you when you when you watch this video, so the fact of the matter is, I used to use these lava lamps all the time a few years back, but not as much anymore. But I'm using but but for today I'm I'm doing this for YouTube for today. One's starting to produce a little bit more, right? This one's starting to produce a little bit more right here. There goes some more.
Keep wa keep watching it, folks. Of course, the thing is, you you definitely do not want to put your hands on these two things at all while they're running, especially now that they've been now that I've had them on for a while, because of course you know they're very hot. They're 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 very hot when when they're on and running. So you do not want to touch them with your bare hands, because believe me, they are they are extremely hot when lava these lava lamps like these two like like these two that I got right here are are very very hot when they're, when they're running. They have to get really really hot in order for the stuff in order for the stuff inside. What you're seeing more of in this one coming up right now, and what you start seeing more in this one as well coming up right now, you know, have to get really hot for for the stuff inside to, to be able to start floating around. And, well, yep, well, one piece in here that came up was one piece was coming down the other piece was going up and they just kind of ran into each other a little bit Yep, this lava lamp's got greenish yellow stuff in it. Greenish yep. Greenish yellow stuff. Greenish yep. Greenish yellow stuff, you know, in it floating around. And this has got kind of blackish, bluish. Well, no. This one, this one here's got blackish, purplish stuff floating around. So what I should say is if and when you watch this video, you know. You know, leave a comment down below on whether you like whether you like this one that's got the got the greenish yellowish stuff floating around. Whether you like this lava lamp that's got the greenish yellowish stuff floating around, or whether you like this lava lamp that's got the kind of blackish, more purplish stuff floating around, floating around, floating around and stuff. Oh, now stuff that was all collected up here for a while has all come down. There goes a big piece in this one right here. Two pieces in this one coming, you know, coming towards each other and touching each other. Then one going down, the other one, the, the other one here going up. As you can see, I got my Christmas lights on in the background too, especially right over here around the window.
So what are you folks all so so what are you, so what are you folks sitting uh, viewers? All all things so far, you you liking watching these two lava lamps, you know, doing their thing? Well, I'm definitely liking watching these two both of these two both of these two lava lamps doing their thing for sure. Some more stuff from this one that collected at the top. Just came back down and there goes another good blob, another good piece going going back up. Looks as if some of the stuff collected up top in this one looks as if it's just dripping back down. That's that's pretty much how it looks, how it is. Some more, some more from here. It's ready to come back down. And this piece ready to go down, and this piece ready to go up. In this lava lamp, in this one right here. Well, well, a little bit more in this lava lamp right here, and this one, and this lava lamp right here was ready to drip down. Some more from down here, and this lava lamp was ready to come up. Well, that piece just broke apart a little bit. <laughs> and just as more stuff just came to the top, a little bit more of what had been collected here coming back down. And it looks like we got three pieces moving in here. One that just went back to the bottom. Another one that's coming back up and another that's coming back down in this one right here. Yep, as you may see, it looks as if it's kind of just bouncing, bouncing down a little bit. Let you see it all up close. Yep. Take a look at take a look at them both up up really close now. I'll show you what I'll show you what it looks like in the bottom of these. That's what it looks like in the bottom of this one, and that's what it looks like in the bottom of this one. fact of the matter is I what I was at first going to plan on doing this way earlier today it's just at first this one right this one right here this one right here that we're looking at at first I thought it wasn't working but then I checked something and the light bulb that's responsible for heating it up was just loose that's all it was so I just decided to try and just tightening it up a little bit and then I plugged it in and tried turning the knob, turning it back, tried turning it on and it it worked. So that's all it was. It was just the light bulb, the light bulb and the light bulb in this one that we're looking at right here was just loose. So that's why it wasn't turning on at first or when I tried this earlier today. But this way by doing it now, both of them were all, both of them were both prepared and stuff and 
and ready to go and up for the challenge. Take a look at this one up close, like this, this close. So you see that right there? Check that out. Yep. Touching a little bit of what was collected on top and was ready to come back down. Yep. Pieces on the other hand coming back down, meeting up with the rest of the stuff here in the bottom. This one. Yep. Two. Two balls, two balls touching each other in this one. So now it's really happening in this one. And it's happening pretty good in it's happening pretty good in this one too. Well there, well, there goes a pretty big piece in this one right here going up. Well, another piece, you know, going down, running into this piece that going up. Some more going in this one. Here's some of our folks next door playing some late night video games and stuff. Yep, yep, you just heard, if you just tuned in, you just heard one of our other guys next door. Yep, really into it with late night video games and stuff. Yep, a little bit hanging up in this one. And came back down a little bit, ready to come back up again. <laughs> Plenty more going on in, in this one right here. Yep, this one getting ready, looking like it's coming close to almost touching what's collected on top, but not quite floating back down. Yep, pretty good glob in this one, you know, just came up. Touching another piece that already came up, smaller piece right here. Oh, oh, check check this one out again. Pretty good glob. Almost floating the top. Now kind of separating a little bit.
Yep, and this one, it looks look, it looks like huge, giant grapes and stuff floating around, but it's not. I want to say it just looks like makeshift slime in this one, on, but it, on, on the other hand, but again, it's not. But again, but it's not. Now in this one it looks kind of like a now now it kind of looks kind of like the shape of a a huge pear and this one looking looking on the bottom of this one right here like I said it looks like giant grapes looks like giant grapes in this one and right now the shape of what we're seeing right now looks like a huge pear a huge pear the shape of a huge pear huge pear huge pear huge pear and stuff in the bottom <laughs> All right, there, folks. That's about that. I think I'm gonna end the. I think I'm gonna end the vlog and the video right here. So, if you enjoyed this uh, lava lamp uh, challenge vlog and video, be sure to be sure to give a thumbs. Be sure to give a thumbs up. Be sure to give a huge thumbs up and and definitely drop a like. Definitely drop a like. Definitely hit that like button and and also be sure to be sure to hit that subscribe button. And again, like I said, leave a comment down below on which um uh, which uh, lava lamp which which lot which lava lamp um which lava lamp you like better of mine? I'd say pretty much. Well, I I want to kind of say I kind of like this one a good bit more over this one, but this one I think maybe it seems a little bit more interesting in the way. You know, so maybe I do like this one more. You know, uh, or maybe I do like this one a little bit more. But yeah, maybe in the end I do like this one a little bit more. But in, but anyway, again, that's 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 gonna do it for that's gonna do it for this vlog and this video. Once again, if you enjoyed this uh, lava lamp challenge uh, vlog and video, again, be sure to be sure to give a huge be sure to give a huge thumbs up. Be sure, be sure to give this vlog and this video a, hu a huge thumbs up. And again, drop a like down below. And and again, once more, leave a comment down below on which one of the two lava lamps of mine that you saw you 
If you like better, leave a comment down below on whether you like this one, the the kind of blackish purple, pur well, kind of more so purple, purple one here, or the greenish yellow one here. Um, uh, and and again, if you're new to my YouTube channel, be sure be sure to hit that subscribe button. And uh, so that's all. That's all for now. I will see you. I will see you on. I will see you on my next vlog. Peace out.